that's bad enough. But what's worse is when they do and cause the loss of jobs. Uh, we've seen in the past trade deals that I believe have caused the loss of jobs. We have another trade deal before uh, the president now uh, coming up. And I wonder if you'd speak to that trade deal and, and what impact it might have on our communities going forward. Well, Mayor, that's a, 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 an especially important question uh, because I think South Carolina has seen, as much as any other state, uh, the pluses and the minuses of trade deals. And every trade deal does have pluses and minuses. And it's our job to maximize the pluses. And so what I have said about this latest trade deal is I want to see the final provisions to determine whether they help protect American jobs, create American jobs, and further our national security. That's my uh, litmus test. When I was a senator, I voted for some trade deals and I voted against some trade deals. So I have no problem, even with the president of my own party, saying that I'm not for it, but I also have no problem if I am for it, saying the same thing. Because I think we've got to be very clear-eyed about the fact we are in a global economy. Now, South Carolina has benefited 